hello everyone welcome back to my channel if today is your first time here you're welcome and if you've been here before thank you very much for coming back everyone watching my videos everyone liking and subscribing i really really appreciate you today's video is just a quick one to show you how to clean the tower 5-in-1 digital air fryer oven this is just a short video i would have another video that shows how you could do a thorough clean and how you could maintain this air fryer but today is just a quick one to show you how you could clean this after using it within five minutes just to give it a quick clean uh, for the next use so this is my air fryer i've just used it for cooking it's a little bit dirty and it's got some oil uh, residue there so the first thing I'll do is to switch it off and unplug it then I'll take out the door and to take out the door all you have to do is just to pull this see open and it comes out quite easily so that's the door. I just give that a clean. Then I'll take out the trays. I'm going to discard this oil and give this um, drip tray a wipe. Then I'll soak the racks and the deep tray in warm soapy water. Just give it a wipe. So remove excess oil. Now to soak the rack and the deep tray, I like to use hot water. So I'm just going to pour the hot water into a bowl. You can use tap water if your tap water is hot enough. But I like to use hot water because that gets all the dirt and all the grease out easily. Then I'm just using like ordinary dishwashing soap. Then I just put the rack in and the deep tray and just leave that soaking for a few minutes. While the racks are soaking, to clean the inside of the air fryer, I'm going to use a kitchen cleaner. This is the Powerforce kitchen cleaner and an absorbent cloth or pad. Then I'll just put, spray that on that and just wipe the interior parts of the air fryer, making sure that I clean all the grooves. area and just give it a thorough clean when I'm done I'll soak it in a bowl of clean water Now the racks have been soaking for a few minutes so I'm just going to use a brush like this. And I'm just going to do that for the remaining racks and the jeep tray. So to clean the door, 
wipe it with the warm soapy water I don't dip this in water because I don't want water to get in between the glass and the plastic so all I do is just give it a wipe and that's usually sufficient to get out any grease So I'm just going to rinse everything now. Just wipe it again. And I just lay everything there to dry or you can just use a dish cloth to wipe as much as possible some water away then you can assemble the air fryer and that is what I'm just going to do now I'm just using this absorbent pad it's really good and I'm just giving the tray a wipe and that goes back Now that is completed, so I just need to put the door back. And to do that, I will align this to a groove in there, and also this goes into another groove there. So just like that goes in there, and push this in. So to conclude the cleaning, I'm going to use the power force again on the dish cloth. I'm just going to wipe all the exterior of the air fryer to remove any grease. Then I'll rinse that in water and give it another one. Then I'll, I'll now finish up with a kitchen towel. And that is how to clean your air fryer. I hope you found this helpful. Nice and clean compared to what it was at the start. I've used my air fryer a lot so I've cleaned it quite a lot so maybe that's why it's got all those watermarks but it still works well it functions well and yeah that is it so thank you very much for watching if you've not subscribed can you subscribe like and share my videos and also turn on your notification bell so that you can be notified when i post new videos thank you very much once again and i'll see you in my next video bye for now